Hello and welcome to the video today. This is the Garbage Bin's Two Wheels. And today on the board, we got Irish Setter by Red Wings. Now I went to the Red Wing store to get a pair of Red Wing boots. I put up a video last time um, telling you guys that I went there to buy a pair of boots and I had my uniforms on and the gentleman at the counter was like, hey, get, let me see your paperwork and I'll get everything started. Just pick your boots out. And I was like, paperwork, what do you mean? He's like, well, your company buys up to uh, $200 of boots. And I was like, what? The Red Wing boots? Because I know they were, they had a company at, that we dealt, we bought boots to them online, but I, I never liked the boots and I just buy my own boots. I had no idea we could get red wings so i went back the next day got the piece of paper then went back so i've had these and it's just now i'm doing the review on them but it's their iris setters by red wings now why i chose iris setter um i just like the looks of them people wear them at work uh they look like a better fit i've wore red wing boots on a on the garbage truck and the heel i didn't like the heel wore on them okay this guy says iris setters are a lot better he sells them to all of us plus um waste management guys and there's no complaints but there's also a better warranty on these boots uh so if i have any trouble i think what's it in the next three four months i can bring these back which i never would do that i would never especially work in this job you know what i mean i wouldn't i wouldn't blame the boot if if the sole fell off I would blame the landfill. But let's open them up and check it out. They are good looking guys. Now, he had me the black boot and I really didn't like the black boot at, at first. I really didn't like it. Let me adjust there a little bit. So I said, can I see the brown one? Absolutely. And so I did. Now the leather, You got, it kind of feels leathery pleathery, okay? Leathery pleathery, but more on the leather side. The sole, I love it. I honestly really, really do. You could tell Red Wing really had a big, really had a big effect right there. Now they are affiliated with Irish Setter, okay? Um, oh, I already got that out. They are affi affiliated with this company, so that's why they sell that's why they sell these boots. Let's just take these off. Let's take these off. Put them down here. So I chose the brown, which I'm really glad I did choose the brown boot. It is good looking. Um, I've wore the boot. The boot fits really nice. Uh, like he says, he had no, there's been no complaints from anybody. And the people I've talked to um since I went back and realized they buy boots about these, these guys, the guys who have them love them because they, you know, they have no blistering effect. Usually right in this area, I don't know how you guys are, usually right in this area, I get really sore with my foot with new boots. And um, there are no complaints to everybody I talk to about them. So that was another, another good um, good thing to point me in the Irish Setter direction. I looked at the Red Wings, I really did, and I liked them, but I wanted to go with something different. Like I said, I had I wore Red Wing before. I wore Thoroughgood. Thoroughgoods wore very, very good um, at work. They really did. They really did. My Red Wings before the heel got chewed up really bad. Now these I usually wear size eleven shoe all the time. Eleven. These are ten and a half. And the guy says, but they fit as an 11. They just run really big. And he doesn't know where at in China. He says they're probably being made, but um, the supplier definitely runs their boots big. And I put them on and uh, they, I wore the, I put the 11 half ons and they were big. They fit like, uh, excuse me, the 11s and they fit like an 11 half, possibly even bigger. So then I went to the 10 and a half and they, they really do. They really do fit well. Now the price on these boots uh, was $185 or $184 and some change. That's not cheap, 
but I didn't pay for them. <laughs> the company did. And um, they will do this once a year, but I can get any boot I want, but they will buy once a year for me. And I thought, man, that's really nice. But this is the problem. I don't wear boots for a year. I wear boots for about four months, three months, and then I go right to another boot. So I have some other ones I'm wearing now, so I'll just go back and forth, you know, doing, doing that. Um, just switching a boot back and forth. I definitely do not wear a boot, a boot a year, and I don't suggest anyone does. It's just way too hard on your feet. You want to take care of your feet, and you don't want your feet smell like, I used to work with a guy who says, feet smell like rabbits. You don't want your feet smell like rabbits, okay? So it's really no big deal to pick a pair up if you can. Now, these are steel toe. Um, this is the first time I'll be wearing steel toe, okay? Uh, so we're gonna have to check how that goes at work. The stitching is beautiful on these. It really is. Eyelets are really nice and strong in there. The boot is just really smooth inside, you know, especially by the heel. It's really made with excellent quality, guys. Uh, I might give you an update on this. The problem is that me giving you an update is that I drive, a, you know, a garbage truck. And sometimes I do have to go in the landfill once a week. Uh, I'm usually running recycle, but once a week, twice a week, I have to go in the landfill and, you know, boots get nasty in there. So that's the only problem. I don't want to, you know, do an update and show you a nasty, disgusting bottom boot. You know what I mean? So that's probably why I won't do an update. If you, you know, and plus in the line of work that I'm in, I know the boot's going to get tore up. Okay. I really know what it is. Now, if it just falls apart the first week, first month, yeah, absolutely. I'll do an update and let you know. But I don't think this boot is going to have any problems at all. But it is, I think it's gorgeous. Like I said, I don't know. The more I feel it, I guess it's, I guess it's a decent leather. The more I feel it, I guess it's okay. So I'm sorry for calling it pleathery. But that may help too, you know, with the rain, it really might help with the rain, you know, with this. So I just think it, it's a cheaper leather. And, um, if I was in roll off at this time, I would put some serious protectant on them because, you know, roll off, you just, you pretty much stay clean throughout the day. But driving the trucks I drive, I get pretty dirty. So I'm going to not put any protectant on it, like I said. And I will be out of this boot in four or five months. I could promise you that. I will promise you that because I just don't, I don't do them long. Here's the other one. It's a good looking boot though. It really is. I, I like the black one, but when I saw the brown one, I definitely wanted it. I've never done a black boot before. I know Thoroughgood really makes some cool ones. Let's take this out. Thoroughgood makes some really, really nice looking ones. Uh, but I, I just like the brown. Brown kind of seems to me it goes with everything you wear. Guys, I think these are I think these are gonna be winners. I really do. You know, more than just they're free, I just think they're going to be a winner. They're, they are a good-looking, good-looking boot. And um, if you're in the market, they are cheaper than the the Red Wing. You know, Red Wings are over 200 Uh The leather's completely different, though. I mean, you get that mock toe Red Wing. It is a, whew, it's a looker. It's a beauty. Uh, but I'm not knocking these at all. You know, for 184 I don't think you can go wrong. And you could casual wear these. You definitely could casual wear these. You really could. But I chose to wear them at work. And I love looking nice at work. I do. I love having nice boots. Keep on uniform up, fitted well. I really do. I like I like that. I like rolling at work that way. So, guys, this is the Garbage Man's two wheels. I'm showing you some new boots. The Irish Setter boot. Affiliated with Red Wing. Sold in Red Wing stores. So if you have any, if you have a Red Wing store near you, check them out, man. And uh, we'll have to see how this boot does. Like I said, the stitching is gorgeous on it. It really is. Good looking stitching. And it's a good looking boot. You could rock this casually easily. You really, you could, man. But I'm going to rock it at work. I'll be looking sharp. Garbage Man's Two Wheels here. Thank you for tuning in. Like, subscribe, comment. I appreciate you guys watching the video. You guys have a good one, and we shall see you again soon. Thank you.